Morning, guys. You're too happy. What happened? I got all A's on my report card. Oh my god, you're so smart. Thanks, I know. But not smart enough to not almost burn the house down using a microwave. That was one time. That was yesterday. What's all this hoopla about? Hoopla, P.O. When were you born? The same time as you guys. 17 years ago. Your vocabulary, it's giving millennial. Go fact yourself. Now someone answer my question. I got straight A's. Good for you, Benny. To celebrate, how about we play your favorite game? Bloxburg? Murder mystery. But that's your favorite. You play it too. That's because you say you'll hoard all the toilet paper in the house if I don't. I love Alan for that. Really? You didn't love me already. Come on, let's play already. Sure, but first I need to, uh, um, to pee. Be quick. Mandy, I've been meaning to tell you something. Please don't say you're in love with me. I know I probably charmed you with my amazing personality, but I'm a lesbian. What? You? No! You were like a sister to me. Plus, I'm gay. Oh yeah, anyway, what's up? Uh, I like P.O. What? It was a couple of weeks ago when I realized I was alone in VC with him and his sleepy voice was so... Please, do not finish that sentence. He seemed so mellow. Maybe because he was tired? We played Zombie Rush and he wouldn't leave my side. He'd even kill all the zombies before attack me. You like him because he played the hero card and protected you from all the zombies? No, I like him because I don't know. Relax, I was just joking with you. Anyway, what happened afterward? I thought I heard him mumble a few things, but it's all a blur since I fell asleep right after. When I woke up the next day, he was still on call with me. What's taking Benjamin so long? I didn't even hear him get up to go pee. Why are you trying to hear him pee? When you say it like that, it sounds weird. It sounds weird however you say it. Okay, we've got to wrap this up. Everyone's getting antsy in the GC. You're right, but before we go back to the main chat, promise me you won't tell anyone about this. I promise. I'm back. I didn't even hear you pee. Okay, you're right, Ellie. It does sound weird. Told you. Can we just play the game now? Okay. During MM2. Alan, you're literally so fucking stupid. The murderer was right in front of you holding a knife. Why did you shoot me? Racially motivated. That's what I'm fucking saying. I thought you were holding a gun. You have glasses for a fucking reason, dumbass. Use them! After another round of murder mystery. Benjamin was right in front of you holding the gun, but you still let him kill you. I didn't let him do diddly squat. First hoopla, now you're saying diddly squat. Seriously, what century are you living in? Pyle costed us a win, and all you can think about is his 19th century vocabulary? Yes. Alan, stop being a piss baby. It was just a game. Well, that was entertaining, but now I'm exhausted. It's only 2134. Exactly too late. Good night, then. Good night. Nighty night. Good night, Ellie Sweet Dreams. Are you guys up for some Bloxburg? I'd rather drown than play that game. Then drown. Choke and dine. Anyway, I'm going to bed. Good night. Do you guys want to play? Actually, Benny, can we talk in my DMs? Sure. What's up? I know we've known everyone in the group chat for around two years, but we still have no idea what anyone in the group looks like. So? Meaning, Pio could be a middle-aged man, and we might not even know it. But don't worry, maybe we can ask him from a face reveal? Are you kidding? There is no way he would oblige to that. Well, that's the only way to see what he looks like. How about we ask the whole GC for a face reveal, that way he won't feel singled out and say no. Oh, that's smart. I can see why you got straight A's now. You couldn't see we before. You don't want the answer to that. You're so fake. Anyway, let's ask them tomorrow morning. I can't wait to see what Ellie looks like. Only Ellie. Well, yeah. I just want to know if her face matches her voice. That's all. Right. Well, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bet. See you tomorrow. The next day. Good afternoon. I feel like you want to tell us something. Mandy, I swear to God if you're asking us to play Adopt Me. No, not today anyway. Last time we played some fucking five-year-old scammed me. We told you that the deal was too good to be true, but you decided you wanted to be stubborn. That kid was a little shit. What did you want to tell us, Mandy? Well, we've known each other for so long, but we've never seen each other's faces. So, we should do a face reveal. Like those Roblox stories. I guess. All right, I'm down. I'll do it just so I can prove that I look better than Pia. I hope you fall down the stairs. 
Amazing. Ellie will go first. Why me? I've wanted to see your face since I met you. Wow. Not creepy at all. Hurry up. I have to wash the dang dishes after this. Fine here. Wow. You are so wow. I'm so what? Beautiful, obviously. Oh, thank you. Stop flirting. It's disgusting. No one here is flirting. And even if we were, you're just mad because you get no beaches. Out of pocket. My turn. You're stunning. Platonic? My god, you're so pretty. They're all right. You seem ballsy today. How about you go next? Whatever. Bark, bark, bark. Bark, bark, bark. Why couldn't I have a normal brother? You're not any different from him. Benny, you're next. Prepare to see the ugliest person in the world. Sounds like someone's projecting. Anyway, here's me. Oh, um, I have to go do the dishes. I'll be back. You look like every white guy on TikTok. I'm not even white. Leave me alone. It's okay. I think you look handsome. Thank you, Mandy. Okay, my turn. I'm so hot you guys might need to wear sunglasses when you look at my photo. Like I was saying. Just do your dang face reveal. Mid. Wow, you're very handsome. He's alright. 3 out of 10. 3 out of 10? You're right. Negative 3 out of 10. Jealous Ellie thinks I'm hot. I am not. Sure. Whatever. Logging off for the day. Alright, bye! Oh, well, do you guys want to play Bloxburg? Sure. Yeah, just give me a minute. Okay, hurry up. Alan, finally, you're here. What do you want? It's about Benny. What about him? I think I like him. Benny, my brother? No dipshit. Benny from the Lego movie All Rights Reserved. You watched the Lego movie? I thought you said that it was for babies and people whose name starts with an A. Focus, Alan. Well, why do you think you like him? I don't know. Maybe it's his voice or how he laughs at the stupid jokes I make. I just know after he did his face reveal, I felt more nervous around him than usual. So you think he's nice looking and has an attractive personality? If I were in your shoes, but with a different person, I would just accept the fact that I like them. That's easier said than done. I've never liked a guy before. I've always thought I was straight. Have you ever liked a girl? No, but I just assumed I just had not found the right one. I have an idea. Give yourself some time to think about your feelings. So you want me to do some self-reflecting? Yes, it always helps me. You reflect on yourself? Of course, doesn't seem like it. You're exhausting. Maybe I should give myself a break from the group chat tomorrow, so I can analyze my feelings or whatever. Okay, have fun. I doubt it. I wonder what's taking Alan so long. Now you know how we felt when you supposedly had to pee. Yeah, I took a long time, didn't I? You weren't really peeing, were you? If I told you what I was actually doing, you won't tell anyone else, right? Do I look like the type to spread around people's secrets? Yes. Just tell me what you were doing. All right, but let's go to our DMs for this. Okay. So I was talking to Mandy. About what? About me liking P.O. That's disgusting, I swear. Gay people have no sense of taste. You literally like my brother. You cannot talk. Fair point. That's why we made you guys do that face reveal. I wanted to make sure P.O. wasn't some random middle-aged man. Oh, please. A middle-aged man would have more common sense than that bird brain. Show out. Whatever. But, Benny. Yes? You do know P.O. is straight, right? He is. I thought everyone in this chat was some variation of gay. Come on, the group chat's name is literally Gay Idiots. That's like saying I'm an idiot because I'm in that group chat. But I am not an idiot, so don't even try me. Look, I'm not completely sure if P.O. is straight, but I don't think he's ever liked a guy. You're right. Please don't be sad, okay? There's still a 1% chance that he's gay. One isn't much. But it's still enough to be considered a number. Anyway, did you reach out to Mandy after they left the chat? No, why? It was so obvious she was angry, but I didn't check up on her. I'm not the best at comforting, and I didn't want to upset her even more. Do you want me to text her to see how she's doing? Yes, please do. I feel awful and just want to make sure she's doing all right. Plus, you're the closest to her. All right, bet. Anyway, I'm off to bed. But it's only 1726. Exactly. Too late. Good night, Benny. Good night. It's not even night yet. If I say it's night, it's night. Now good night. Good night. Mandy. What? She wanted to check up on you. 
She told me she's bad at comforting and she didn't want to make you even more upset. She could never make me upset. I am love texting her. Do you want me to tell her that? No, she'll think I like her. But don't you like her? Yes, but she doesn't need to know that. Plus, she likes Alan. Try to talk to her privately more. Maybe that'll strengthen your bond and make her attracted to you. Mmm, I'll think about it. If you do decide to chat with her, you'll have to wait until tomorrow. She's sleeping right now. It's only 5 o'clock. That's what I said. Anyway, Alan's calling me to give him some toilet paper. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Vinny says you're asleep. You've been going to bed earlier and earlier lately. I know. Oh my god. I didn't expect you to answer. Did I wake you up? I'm so sorry. I was already awake, so you're good. I'm glad I didn't wake you. Oh, I want to ask you something. Go ahead. Are you okay? What do you mean? You've been going to sleep earlier and earlier each day. Usually, when someone is sad they sleep more. I was just thinking, are you feeling sad? Mandy, you don't have to worry about me. Please answer the question. Ellie, I really care about you and want to make sure you're okay. I'm not okay right now, but I will be. Do you want to talk about it? I promise I won't tell anyone what you tell me. Have you ever liked someone but they were too oblivious to see it? I think I may have experienced that at one point. It can hurt, especially when they don't realize you're making a move on them. Yes, that's exactly how I feel. Wait, does this mean you're crushing on someone? Yeah, I guess. Who's the person? I'll give you a hint. Their avatar has white skin, glasses, and has an A in their name. Oh my god, is it me? Oh, um, no. It's Alan. Haha, ha, I was joking. You know, I could always ask Alan how he feels about you. No, that's alright. Besides, I... I could ask him tomorrow. Mandy, you don't have to. As your friend, I should and I will. Matter of fact, consider it done. You're not listening. Oh, look at the time. I have to go walk my dog. Bye, Ellie. Mandy, I like you and Alan. The next day. P.O. hasn't been online all day. Yeah, he told me he wanted to reflect on himself today. P.O. reflects on himself. Yeah. Tell him it isn't working. He just started today. When will he back? Probably tomorrow. All right, bye guys. Where are you going? To bed. Now that it's just the three of us. Alan, what are your opinions on Ellie? Why are you asking him this when I'm right here? She's a great friend. I mean, romantically. I don't like her romantically. I have a girlfriend. Since when? I can add her to the group chat. Please do, because you have to be lying. This is Pixel. Hey. Mandy, can I speak to you in DMs for a second? Of course. Mandy, I told you I didn't want you to ask him how he felt about me. Maybe you didn't hear me repeatedly tell you it's okay. You don't have to because you kept talking over me. Ellie, I'm really sorry. I didn't realize. I didn't realize my ass. Maybe you would have realized if you would shut up for a second. God. Mandy, why won't you listen? Is there anything I can do to fix this situation? For right now, I just want you to leave me the fuck alone. Benny, I fucked up. Ellie is really mad at me. Like, indescribably upset. What did you do? All I did was ask Alan how he felt about Ellie. I thought that was what she wanted. Why do you think she would want that? I don't know. Hold on, I'll be back. Oh good, you're online. I thought you were sleeping. I was but someone texted me. Is something wrong? Earlier, after you left, Mandy asked Alan how he felt about me. Beforehand, I told her I didn't want her to. But she did anyway. Whatever, we found out he doesn't even like me romantically. And he even has a girlfriend. So you're mad at Mandy for not listening? No, I'm mad at her for thinking I cared about if Alan liked me or not. Now she probably thinks I really like him when in reality, I'm starting to lose feelings for him. I'm so confused. I'm mad because Mandy thinks I like Alan when I actually like her. Benny, are you there? Yes, hi. I think I should get over Ellie. What? Ellie deserves someone better than me. Besides, she doesn't even like me like that. How are you so sure she doesn't like you? How are you sure she likes me? Mandy, it's just an argument. I bet Ellie isn't even mad anymore. I guess anyway, I'm going to bed. Okay, good night Mandy. Benny, are you awake? Yes, I'm still awake. Should I go apologize to her? I'll be right back. All right. I'm so tired. I can barely keep my eyes open. Ellie, I'm going to go to bed. Fuck, I think she blocked me. Why the fuck did she block me? This is all my fault. 
I shouldn't have went off on her. I'm so stupid. She never had ill intentions. I at least should have told her how I felt in a calmer tone. Don't blame yourself. It was just an argument. I'm sure everything will be back to normal by tomorrow. You're right. Thanks, ah, Benny. Spaghetti. Benny. Benny. Ah, Benny, are you still there? Forget this self-reflection shit. I want to play Roblox. It's 2 a.m. Why is Benny online? He has a test in this morning. I guess I should message him. Good morning, nerd. Why are you up so early? Go to bed. You have school in less than five hours. He isn't responding. The dumbass probably fell asleep on Roblox again. Whatever, I should probably go to sleep too. The next day. The group chat is awfully quiet today. Yeah, I think there's some drama going on. Who are you? Fan insert. Okay, where's Benny? In his room. He's been refusing to come out since he got home. Oh my god. Hi, Alan. I love you, baby. I forgot you existed. Benny tells Alan everything. So if Benny isn't willing to talk to him, something must be really wrong. Alan, you shithead. Why are you talking about how Benny is acting like it's normal? Whatever. If Alan won't figure out what's wrong with Benny, I will. Benny, get your ass over here. Hey, Keo, what's up? It's a little concerning that you haven't talked in the group chat at all today. Why is it concerning? Because you usually talk in the chat more than everyone else. Focus, dumbass. What's bothering you? Uh, P.O., I. Yeah, I failed my exam. It's my final exam. I can't have my grade go down. You have all A, don't you? The most it will bring you down to is A, B. I cannot get A, B. What's wrong with B? They're my favorite letter. Why are B your favorite letter? That's irrelevant right now. Stay on topic. Sorry, I'm kind of all over the place because of last night. I think that's why I failed my test. What happened last night? Forgot. You weren't online yesterday. Basically, Ellie and Mandy had an argument or something. They both kept coming to me for reassurance and event, but I can only help one person at a time. Plus, I was really tired and wanted to go to sleep. Give me a second. Okay. Dumbass 1 and Dumbass 2, get over here. I'm guessing that self-reflection didn't work out. Why are we all in a group chat together? Listen up because I'm only going to say this once. Leave Benny out of your relationship. But we aren't dating. Relationship also means friendship, dumbass. Now shut up and let me finish talking. Benny failed his final exam today because you two shit were keeping him up all night with your drama. Oh my god, what did I miss? How did you get into this chat? You accidentally added me. Anyways, I understand you guys need someone to talk to, but you can't keep going to him every time. You guys need to learn to communicate rather than ranting to Benny. You're right. We need to apologize. Damn, well, you do. Thanks for telling us. Sorry, my mom was calling me. Two days later. It's been two days. Benny still isn't online. Neither has Alan. But Alan isn't online much anyway. Has anyone tried to text either of them? I did. Yesterday, I texted them both and no response. Wait, it says Alan is online. Hello. Hi, where have you been? Hospital. Oh, are you sick? Well, whatever it is, I hope you get well soon. Yeah, what Mandy said. No, I'm not here for myself. What do you mean? Benny was admitted into the hospital a couple of days ago. I'm all from work to keep him company. What's wrong with Benny? According to the doctor, he passed out due to exhaustion. He's admitted to not eating at all. So that's probably why too. He hasn't been eating. Apparently not. He said he often forgot to eat because he was studying or he felt like he wasn't worthy of food because he hasn't been doing so well in school. Are you not worried? I'm extremely worried. Why are you asking? You don't sound like it. Hey, calm down. Let's not start an argument, especially right now. Why didn't Benny tell us about this? I mean, he did show signs of overworking himself. But I would never have thought it would be this bad. It's okay. I didn't know either, and I live with him. Alan. Do you think we can come visit him? We all live relatively close to each other. I'm sorry that the hospital won't let us have any visitors. Plus, Benny would kill me if he found out I told you all this. Why? He didn't want to make you guys worry. So randomly disappearing and not telling us anything is supposed to make us feel better. Please calm down. Alan didn't do anything, so stop getting mad at him. Benny is going back home tomorrow. Can't talk to him in any way. Have to go. The nurse is calling me back in. All right. See you tomorrow, Alan. Bye. We should all go to sleep now. It's pretty late. Good night. 
Good night, Ellie. Sweet dreams. Wait, before you go, I need to tell you something. Oh, what is it? Man, do you really like you? I don't expect you to reciprocate my feelings or anything, but I just wanted you to know. You like me? Don't ever talk to me again. Just kidding. I got you, didn't I? But to be completely honest, I like you too, Ellie. Do you want to be my girl? The next day. Oh, and you said Benny was going to be out of the hospital today? He's sleeping right now. We should play Zombie Rush while we wait. Sure. A few hours later, the group chat finishes playing. So what should we do now? Benny, we missed you. We were worried. Yeah, I'm really sorry. Didn't tell you guys about anything until we explained you because what happened? You think a little sorry is going to change the fact you didn't tell us about how you were in the hospital? You like it can go back in time and fix everything, but I really am sorry. Can we talk about this later? No, we need to talk about it now. I was worried for the past three days. Benny being in the hospital was all I could think about. I told you, I'm sorry. Hey, calm down. Don't tell me what to fucking do. You know what, fact this. Of course none of you guys understand. Why is he so angry? Maybe he woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Do you guys remember Lucas? Yes, but what's that got to do with anything? Where's Lucas? I forgot. You had your phone naked away from you. It's kind of a long story. I have nothing better to do, so I don't mind. Okay, fine. We met someone on Arsenal server and invited to our group. He ended up becoming really close to Pio, which was weird because everyone hated Pio back then. Really? It was a joke. Half joke. Ah. Anyway, a couple of months passed and Lucas was acting weird. For example, he really joined the was never online now and was very dry. It all made sense a month later. It turned out he was in the hospital for attempted suicide. He promised us he was okay afterward and was getting help. Was he okay? Nope, he passed away. I'm assuming when you were in the hospital, Pio had flashbacks to Lucas nevertheless. That still doesn't justify how Pio was acting toward you. I think we should make a petition for Pio to get therapy. Why didn't you just tell me about Lucas when I got my phone back? I personally didn't feel like revisiting that trauma at that moment, but we should have told you sooner. Sorry, Benny. It's fine. At least I can somewhat understand why you got so mad earlier. I'm going to go talk to him tomorrow once he pulls off or now I'm going to bed. I'm tired. Benny, it's only 2030. Exactly. Too late. Anyway, tonight. I can't believe he stole my phrase. Oh, I get why Pio is upset now. When Benny was in the hospital, that must have reminded of Lucas. I literally just said that. But I said it better. I hope you drown. You love me. I hate you people. The next day, Benny attempts to message Pio. I couldn't reach you through Discord, so I'm texting you here. Please, can we talk? Day pass. Pio doesn't answer. Benny and Alan end up in a car crash. Alan was horribly wounded. Benny drifted into a coma due to service injury to his brain. Two months pass, no answer. Alan recovers, but randomly disappears from all social media, leaving Mandy and Ellie. Of course, the two girls remain a couple, but often think about Alan and Benny. Three months later, I can't believe I found you guys. Hey, you are back. I told you we should have blocked him on Roblox. What's with the attitude? Why are you mad? Not sure. Maybe because you completely gorged all of us for months. I didn't. I know I was gone for such a long time. There's a reason for it. Go ahead. Why did you leave us for months? Well, I'd much rather wait until Benny is online. You can't. Why? Benny passed away a month ago. He was in a coma. Alan told us the bills were too much to pay, so they gave up on him. They unplugged the cord. You're joking. You're not joking. No, now get lost. We don't want to talk to you. Listen, I understand I was wrong. There's nothing you can do to fix the past. Just listening for a fucking second. You have one minute. After the fight with Benny, I obviously felt awful. Really? Is that it? Shut the fuck up. Anyway, after the argument I left my room to go to my church. I needed time to clear my head because I was not going to go back to Benny angry. You both know that wouldn't have ended well. For 30 seconds. My mom, she found my messages with Alan. About what? About me admitting I liked Benny. Of course she was confused, but when I told her Benny was a guy, she went ballistic. She smashed my laptop, phone, and some other random stuff. She kicked me out and sent me to live with my aunt. I didn't have money to buy a new phone or computer, so there was no way I could communicate with you guys. Pio, 
I'm so sorry. Don't be. Is Alan still here at least? He hasn't been on since Benny died. All right, I'll be back. I just need some time to process this. Of course, take as much time as you need, P.L. Also, always remember, we'll always be here for you. Yes, we really care for you. I care about you guys too. Erica, Erica, answer me. Yes, babe. Look, I'm gonna make it short and simple. We are breaking up. Wait, are you joking, Hayden? I'm not joking, Erica. Is it that I'm ugly? I'll change for you, Kaden. You don't have to change. I just don't love you no more. I did everything for you for two years. Now you're gonna leave me like shit? Exactly like that. I'm just so shocked. I worked my ass off for him just to please him. I'm gonna just go tell Brianna and Zeke. Hey. Hey, Bree. What's wrong? You sound sad. He broke up with me. Hey, bitches. Bru, you cut off Erica. Okay, cool. Can I add my brother? Um, sure. Hayden, what are you doing here? Stop yelling at my brother Erica. That's my ex Zeke. Calm down, you ugly beach. Don't talk to my friend like that. Drama is crazy right now. Join the private call with me now. Erica, you better not. Go get your brother. You live with him, right? What the actual fuck is wrong with you? I was trying to get away from you. Clearly you missed the message. I said I don't love you no more, but you still follow me everywhere I go. I don't care no more. You used me for two fucking years. I'm done with you, Kaden. Fuck you. That beach will pay. I think we should kick her. Guys, what happened? You think we are dumb, right? What? We heard the recording, Erica. So quit the act. I didn't do anything. So you think calling me a no mom boy is funny? Why would I say that about you? I know you did something, you bastard. I haven't done anything. Caden, play the recording for this brat. Ugh, let me get started off with this. No mother kid, Zeke. His mother left him for Jaden and his dad and Brianna is such a pygmy, also a beach to this earth. So I'm a pygmy now. I would never say that about you both. We've been best friends since elementary. It sounds just like you. Please just listen to me. I want to explain, please. Fuck you, Erica. I thought we were all friends. Looks like all those years gone. You've been kicked. No, no. I lost my only friends. I'm gonna go play shadow boxing battles to get my mind off of it. She joins shadow boxing battles. Wait, isn't that Kaden? When do I get my money for that? I'm gonna give it now. I hate her so much I had to get rid of her. I even managed to give those worthless pieces of nothing on my side. It's kinda messed up, dude. I got proof now. Erica? Fact this, I'm out. If you show anyone this, I will make your life hell. Yeah, okay. I don't care what you say. Boo boo. Answer, beach. What do you want? You made me cry. Please look. I have proof I didn't say that. Erica shows the recording. OMG, I'm so sorry, eh. I'll show Zeke now. I just saw it, eh. I'm so sorry, I thought he was telling the truth. Look, guys, I cannot forgive you both since you believe him over me. I'm sorry. AC. Hey April, what's up? I finally found a friend group. It felt like I was searching for years. Awesome. Can I join it? Of course. April adds Macy to the group. April, why would you add a softy to our group? I'm not softy, but okay. Is there a problem? It's very big problem. Girls, stop being mean to her. Can you just not see that we don't like softies? They're so boring and weird looking. Excuse me. Shut the hell up. Softy, no one was talking to you. Why are you guys so mean? Oh my god. I might just leave. Yes, good idea, ugly rat. Why you guys gotta be so mean? She's my best friend. Sorry, but why the hell are you even friends with a fucking softy? She wasn't a softy when I met her. She changed her style and I'm fine with that. Anyways, let's forget about that rat. I have a boyfriend since yesterday. Mind if I add him? If you want, add him. Yes, bestie add him. Oh my god, so handsome, what's your name? Oh, I'm Owen, what's yours cutie? Bree. Um, why are you flirting with my man? 
I'm not, I'm just being nice. Anyways, I'm April. Nice to meet you, Owen. Yes, you too. Hey, baby. Yes, yes babe. darling. Um, Bree, he was talking to me, right? Yeah, I don't even know you, Bree. Fuck you. Ah. Uh, Let's leave April, they're so toxic. What? Babe, your friend is so weird. This is the weirdest conversation I've had so far. I am just gonna go back to my normal dear friend. Goodbye. Oh my god, you're so toxic as well. Shut the hell up, Bree. What the hell was that? Oh, hey again. Oh my god, hey Macy, I got to tell you something crazy that just happened. Alright, tell me. Okay, so... Oh wait, my friends are calling me on Discord, be right back. A few minutes later. Sorry, that took so long. It's alright, I guess. Oh, I forgot to tell you that I got a friend group as well. I was gone really quick when your friends were talking mean to me about being a softie, so I went to look for a softy friend group. Oh, well I don't have that much friends anymore because I left them, they were all acting super weird. Can I join your friend group? Oh, I'm sorry, they're all softies and I don't think they like those kind of styles. So you should go look for friends that have the same style as you have. Also, I don't think we should be friends anymore. What? Why? Because I don't want to get bullied being a friend of an emo kid. You also look like a homeless girl that just woke up from a really long coma. That's so rude. I don't care. Bye freak. Dang. That hurts. I am just gonna look for friends. You have the same style as me, like Macy said. Facts softy. I'm just gonna play Dahood or something. Ten minutes later. Hey yeah. Oh, hey. You're so good. Oh my god. Oh, thanks. Haha. -ha. Wanna be friends? Of course. Nice. I'm Daniel. Cool. I'm April. How old are you? I'm 14. Cool. Me too. Do you have Discord by any change? Duh. It's... I added you. All right. So want to tell me something about yourself? Well, I just lost all of my friends, and now I don't have anyone to talk to or to hang out with. Wow, that sucks. But now you have me also. I have a friend group. Want me to add you? I think they'll love you. Oh, really? I'd love to. Oh, hey, Daniel. Who's this cutie you added? This is April. Hey. Hi, I'm Davina. I'm Ryan. Nice to meet you guys. You too. So, Daniel, where did you find this cute girl? Stop calling her a cutie. I met her in the hood. Um, so why can't I call her a cutie? She might get uncomfortable. No, Daniel, it's all right. Tyler is like this with every girl, so you might get used to it. Yeah, he's such a weirdo. Shut up. I'm not weird at all. Can't I just give a compliment? That sounds a bit weird. Haha, <laughs> you guys are so funny. Wow, thank you, cutie. I had a really weird friend group before this one. Oh, really? Yes. April explains the whole story. Oh, LMAO. What the actual hell? That sounds so weird. Anyways, I got a girlfriend. Can I add her girlfriend? 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 Since when you got a girlfriend? You got a girlfriend before me. That's impossible. Yeah, you gotta be lying, Ryan. I'm not. Wait, you got a girlfriend but still called April cute? Yes, is it wrong? Well, it depends. I don't want to see her. What? Why? Is it because you have a crush on Ryan? What? Ew. No. Well, you definitely are. Just shut up. In leaving. LMAO. I'm sure she does, bro. I mean, it's normal. Everyone does. Bruh. Just add her, Ryan. All right. What the fuck, Ryan? Please tell me you were joking. Don't tell me it's because you have a crush on me too. What? No, I know this girl. Uh. Did you got kicked out of your softy group? No. Do they know about your emo boyfriend? No. What? Why? I just didn't have any time to tell them that. Or you were just scared to get kicked out. Shut up. You don't know anything. Where do you guys know each other from? She was my best friend, but then she left me for those softy kids. No, you left me first. I didn't wanted you to leave that group. But then you decided that you wanted to leave, so shut up. Ugh, babe, she's being mean. Uh, April, don't be so mean to her. Ryan, what the fact? Ugh, simp. No, he just loves me, isn't it, darling? Yes, I love her so much. When did you guys meet? Like two days ago. No, last week. 
Shut up, April. You are just jealous. Nope, never. So anyway, what's your name, a new girl? I'm Macy. What about you? Pretty boy. Straight up flirting with another boy in front of your boyfriend. I didn't flirt. Ah, oh, I am Daniel. Yeah, we know. He was talking to your girlfriend, Ryan. April, shut up. No one cares. You shut up, annoying piece of shit. April, calm down. I'd be calm if this annoying kid wasn't here. I don't like here either, but we have to be nice because it's Ryan, his girl. Uh, do you guys know? I can see everything you guys are saying about me. Yeah, we just don't care about your opinion, so shut up. Guys, enough, stop being so mean to my baby. Okay, we'll stop. I just know that Macy is gonna turn Ryan into a softie. April, stop. Whatever, let's just play. Can I join? No. Shut up, April. Of course you can join, babe. Yay. With Davina. I hate her so much. What? Who? Ryan, his new girlfriend. Oh, so you are jealous too. What? No, his girlfriend is my ex-bestie. For real, what a coincidence. April, I know you don't like her, but just try to be nice. She's now part of the group because it's Ryan, his girlfriend now, so you have to get along. Okay, I'll try. Amazing, now join this call. So you're telling me Ryan, his girlfriend is there too? Yes, but please don't leave. Ugh, fine. Hey guys, wait, who is this girl? She's part of our group. Shut up, I didn't ask. Bruh. Daddy Ryan, who is this girl? Are you cheating on me? Bruh, I already hate her. Baby, please kick her. She's being mean. Sorry, Davina, but I have to do it. No, don't. Why? Davina has every right to be here to let her stay. Okay, fine. Ugh. The next day. Hey guys, I'm sorry for having a bad mood yesterday. I'd like to start over. So you are apologizing now to me? Well, to be honest, yes. But then I remembered how mean you were to me, so no. Um, what? We'll forgive you. Sorry for being rude, I guess. It's okay. Anyways, no one mentioned yet how old you were. Oh, I'm 14. No, you are not. Yes, I am. You're 12. I'm trying to become a better person. Why would I suddenly start to lie? Yeah, you tell me. Why are you trying to make me look bad? Because you are. Okay, that's enough girls. Yeah, April, just stop. You guys are so annoying. Which one should I leave? April. Macy. Can you guys shut the hell up for a moment? I didn't ask you. Sorry. So Daniel Ryan, which one? April. Daniel. I'll just go talk with April alone. Sure, I guess. Davina, can we be besties? Um, sure. Anyways, what do you guys want to play? What about Dahood? Um, all right. I'll join you guys later, all right. Hey, April? Yeah. Can you please be a little more nicer to Macy? No, because I have a plan with Davina. Huh? What kind of plan? So I'm pretending to hate her so much. And Davina pretends to be her bestie, so we can later get her out of the group. If you don't understand, then you'll see later what's gonna happen. And I know you'll think this is the worst and meanest idea to exist. But trust me, everyone is gonna be happier when she's gone. You know, I won't say anything, it's not the best, but it's a pretty good idea. Okay, good that you are siding with us. But what if the idea turns out bad? Like that you have to leave the friend group and Macy is going to stay. Well, I'd stop playing Roblox, that's for sure. But we would still be friends, right? Of course, and if you need any help with your plan, just tell me. Okay, thank you, now let's see what's going on in the group chat. But before we go... I want you to not talk about this with anyone, even your friends, and definitely not your girlfriend. Of course not, I won't betray you, you can trust me, I'm always here for you. Um, okay, let's get back to the group chat now. Ugh, she's back. Ah, someone missed me. No one did, but just letting you know that me and Davina are besties now. Yeah, besties for life. That sounds like bullshit. Do you want to be our bestie too, emo boy? No one wants that. Do not call me emo boy. You're just jealous. Your mom is. That's the only comeback you know now. No, it's just the funniest one. April, no. no. 
Oh, no. But it sounded pretty funny though. No, it didn't. Oh my god, no, April's so lame, so bad joke, oh my god, boo. Oh my god, that's so rude. My own bestie said that I was unfunny. Don't call her bestie, she's mine, you ugly rat. Yeah, that's my girly. Ryan, you think that April is an ugly rat? Yes, because I'm on my baby her side. Rude. Hmm, something seems off. April Davina, can we private chat for a second? Sure. So what's going on between you two? What do you mean emo boy? Seriously. LMAO, but what do you mean? Why aren't you guys friends anymore? This is part of our plan to get Macy out of the group. Plan? Oh, you don't know it yet? No. Oh, well. Explain the whole plan. Oh, um, you guys think that's going to work? Why don't you guys just kick her out of the group? Because of Ryan? Yeah, we are just trying to make her do something bad. Then we'll tell that to Ryan and then he'll break up with her. Good luck, I guess. Let's go back now before Macy finds out our plan. Oh my god, yay. Bestie is back. Yes, of course. What were you guys private chatting about? Your mom. Still not in April. Yeah, it's so unfunny. Yeah, for real. Shut up. You used to say that all the time. Ugh, stop lying. You stop. No, you ugly brat. Shall we do a face reveal? Then we'll see who is ugly. Okay. Yeah. No. Why not? Are you scared? Haha. -ha. No, I just don't want to show my thoughtful face to your ugly. Don't call them ugly. They're all ugly. Don't change my mind. Let's do a face reveal then. Let's do it at the same time. Bet. You and babe. Ugh, fine then. Okay, one, two, three, now. Uh, why didn't you guys show? Because you didn't show us yours. I just did. That's from Google. No, it's not. Look, I don't have proof, but that's literally Loren Gray. Oh, I didn't know. Bruh. Babe, are you a catfish? Oh no, I am Loren Gray. Are you for a real bra? Um, no, it's a joke. Then show us your real face. Macy was kicked OUE of the group chat. Oh, now she was uglier than I remember. Shut up. You can stop being mean now. Yeah. LOL. Sorry. Say sorry to Macy, you facker. Oh, so now you are mad. What the fact did you expect me to be? Happy? Happy because my love of my life got kicked out of this group. Your what? Love of my life. Embarrassing. Yes, embarrassing for you because didn't found your soulmate yet and probably never will. Macy was so nice and funny. She even was pretty and super cute. Fuck you, April. What? I hate you so much. Go dine in hell. Don't say that, Ryan. I know she did wrong. But don't say that. It's not nice at all. I'm sorry, Daniel. You're my bro. But she literally should go and dine. You took it too far. Don't worry, Ryan. I'm on my way. Wait, no. We have to stop this. Oh, this is getting intense. Wait, let me get some popcorn first. Oh, shut up. Okay. Sorry, but I can't be the only one that wants April out of here. You want me to leave, so your girly can come back? Exactly. To be honest, I want April to leave, but Macy can't come back. Why? I can't stand either of them, but sorry, they are both acting like a pick-me and are super annoying. I want the old group back where there wasn't in April or in Macy. Same, like I still want to be with Macy, but I don't want her in this group. So is it fine with everyone? What about you, Daniel? I don't care. Um. Is that a yes, Daniel? Guess so. Now April leave quickly. Hurry up you slow beach ass. With pleasure. Oh. April is playing alone. Did she got kicked out of the group too? Uh, why do I even care? She was such an asshole to me, but I was a bit mean too. Uh, whatever. Hi. Uh, hey. Did you got kicked out of the group too? Yeah, LMAO. That sucks. Um, look, I'm sorry for how I acted. Uh, don't worry. It's fine. I don't mind anymore. Do you want to befriend again? We can start over. If you don't, that's fine. I get it. Haha. -ha. Yeah. Of course. Why did you got kicked out though? I don't know. They randomly started to defend you and they all hated me. It came out of nowhere. I thought they all hated you. But no, they hated me, especially Ryan. He hated me the most. He kept on sending me death treats. Oh. 
Are you guys still together? Nope, I broke up with him. LOL, I bet he's broken now. What? Why? He said that you were the love of his life. Oh hell nah, he was definitely lying. He never came, talked to me like he only talked to me in the group chat. Bruh, how did you meet him? Oh, I was just playing ragdoll and then he came up to me. He then asked me to be his girlfriend. Can you believe that? He didn't even know me. But anyways, I said yes, just for fun. LMAO, so you trolled him the whole time? Yes, he's so dang stupid. I also acted like a pick-me when I saw you were in the group. Dang girly, it was low-key fun too and embarrassing. Yeah, LMAO, I'm kind of tired of talking. Wanna play something? Sure. Wow, this feels so much better when she's gone. Just stop talking about her. She left like two days ago. Um, Ryan, are you still with Macy? No. In mind, yes.